in my hands I have the coolest sketchbook because it's made by David Shrigley and when I saw this in Edinburgh um, in just a small art shop it says no one disrespects my drawings and I thought it was so fun and I just fell in love with it and I've been drawing and really being inspired I think the fact that it's David Shrigley's work and the sketchbook it it gives me more discipline and just more creative inspiration uh, to be doing work in such beautiful sketchbooks. So I got some new things. It's from a store called Brain Box Candy and it's from the UK. So let's open it up because I got some goodies. So here is the package. I have so many sketchbooks already, but I have sketchbooks for each purpose, I would say. I have smaller sketchbooks for landscapes and then for traveling. So I need them all. So I got two more sketchbooks. The first one, it says, it has always been my desire to be an artist, but I find it incredibly fucking hard. And... It's around 10, I think 10 or 12 euros, but honestly, it's so much worth it because I just love how it looks. Then this one, um, my artwork is terrible and I am a very bad person. I thought it was funny and it has 144 pages and it's 135 grams of thickness for the paper, so it's really great. Then I got this magnetic uh, bookmark. It says, I lick the words that you have read. And then I got some postcards. One more pot of coffee to help you concentrate. Then this one, our vibes, my vibe, your vibe. I really loved it. And then this one, you are very important. And there's a smiley face. I decided to give myself a names day present because we celebrate Names Days here in Latvia. It's a pretty big celebration. So I thought, I thought I would be very happy to receive David Shrigley goodies. I still want to put art on this wall, uh, but I still have to figure out which one. But until then, I ordered some sketchbooks. I also got a free postcard, a greeting card. It says, hello, cowboy. So I am so excited and I'll be, <clears throat> I'll probably share at one point when I'm finished with the sketchbook. It is pretty heavy, so I mostly use it for just being at home, um, but I've been really enjoying doing pencil drawings and I'm really loving it because I have started liking more just the traditional medium over digital <clears throat> but it's fine we all change so i'll put a link down below um with david shrigley's work and the brain bug the and also where i ordered it so i'll go put this in my book now so that I actually use it and not just look at it because it's so pretty. Bye! Hello chickens, it's a different day, it's a different week, but I got an exciting package from the UK as well. I ordered some goodies from Charlotte Egger and I'm so excited because I love her art. It's so cute. So I got a few things and before I unpack, there were these two First, it's a postcard, and then we have this, which is like a thank you card, and it's all cake themed because I got her book, it's Cake Tales, and it's just filled with gorgeous illustrations and stories about cakes. Um, there's even my favorite one. I love cake. I like I love cake. And it's this tampoos. It's a Dutch 
delicious, delicious creamy cake. And then I also got this. I got a set of, I think, 10 postcards. And what I love is that they are Risso printed and I love Risso printing. It's just cute animals. I love it. How cute is that? I have actually started gathering postcards and greeting cards so that I always have just something special when I need for a birthday or for any thing, then I'll have all of these cute postcards and they're too cute. Oh, I, I always get these things and then I never want to use them because they're so cute. I think this is my favorite. That's the haul. I'm very happy I have um, all these goodies and I think I just love buying artsy things to support other artists because I know how much it means to me when I when someone orders my poster, whether it's a digital or uh, something that I've made here in Latvia in an art market, it means the world to us artists when you support and when you're actually excited about using uh, what we made. Thank you. Have a lovely day. I'll go make some pasta, but uh, see you later.